Okay, today I'm going to do a video on starting the 1950 Harley Davidson Flathead 45 Solo Stroker. Okay, let's get at it. Okay, before that, let's just take a little walk around the bike and I'll point out a few things to you. Uh, Springer front end, horn, headlights. This is the right front brake. The right I'm sorry, this is the front brake, mechanical. This is the oil tank. This is the gas tank, oil, gas. Uh, this is the motor, this is the distributor, rear brake, crash bars, footboards, kickstarter, uh, clutch, lever, chain guard, chain. This is the race pipe. This is what you have to use to actually ride it and start it. The chrome one is just for show. This one's a straight through pipe with no baffles. Uh, the other one has too much restriction. Uh, here's the rear brake, here's the speedo drive, rear fender, seat, battery, 12 volt battery, tail light, brake light, rear wheel again, seat, um, coil, battery box, primary, head, cylinder, Key and carburetor, and a full, uh, element, uh, air cleaner element, gas line, with the gas shutoff valve here. And when that's down, screwed all the way in, it's off. And then when it's unscrewed, it is open. And then if, to put it on reserve, if you run out of gas, you got to reserve, pull it up. Okay, here's your gear shift. You got neutral in the second notch, first and the first, third and second and third. It's three speed. Uh, you got your rocker clutch here. Um, when the clutch is disengaged, it's in this position. When it's engaged, it's heel down. That means the clutch is in and it should stay in and then when you want to go back into gear and accelerate and, and take off, you rock it back down like that and then it'll be in gear. Oh, what else we got? Your instrument cluster. Uh, this is your switch, speedometer. This is uh, engine on, ignition on. And this is lights on. And you can see by you can see by the lights, the lights are on. And the tail light is on. So if you hit the brake, you'll see that the brake light goes on the pedal. Okay, I'll just put it back on ignition. This is off. This is accessories, but accessories are not, not hooked up. So that's off. There is no key. Some, someday there was a key. Um, these idiot lights here, one is for oil pressure. One is for generator. When the red's on, it means there's no oil pressure. When this is off, it means this would be green. Uh, when this is off, you don't have any charging to the battery or the generators are not functioning properly. So, of course, they would be on when the bike is not on. And going forward, uh, there's a generator down there, and uh, you got a solid state regulator. Uh, your linkage for your shifter, which goes back to your transmission. And <laughs> okay, the first thing you want to do is make sure it's a neutral. Neutral is a second click back right here. It's numbered one, two, and three. 
and neutral is not numbered or lettered. It's the second notch. It's a three speed. First, second, third, neutral. Make sure it's in neutral. Make sure the gas is on. There's a gas shutoff valve here. You unscrew it. Once it slows, you get gas flowing to the carburetor. You pull it up, that's for reserve. I've also put an additional gas valve in line just to make sure we don't have any leakage. Next thing is we want to uh, retard the timing for starting. And to retard it, you turn it clockwise all the way to the go, which is about a uh, fifth of a turn. And fully advanced would be counterclockwise, all the way about a fifth of the turn. Now, when we start it, we want to have it like halfway between full retard and full advance. So you set it about halfway. And as the bike warms up, you'll want to um, uh, advance the distributor, advance the timing. Okay, then we're ready for our primer kicks. Okay, when I start to say, I'm going to take straight primer kicks. Now, the first thing I'm going to do, give it some gas. I'm going to goose it about six times. And I'm going to give it one kick with the uh, throttle open, okay? And I'm going to titrate the kicker so I've got it right at the Put it TDC. And I just kick it through once, close the throttle. I'll kick it through another time. Then a third time. And I'll turn on the ignition. Ignition's on. Leave the throttle closed. Titrate the kicker.
provide for you, but uh, it's also rain. <laughs> so uh, that's it. If any questions, uh, you know how to get a hold of me. Yes, off, mission off. little motorcycle. I'm a little bit too tall to ride it. Uh, just had a broken ankle and my left foot doesn't do the rock clutch, so there was suicide clutch, but that's the way really things set up. Stroke motor, it will cruise at 70, truthfully, and um, it's a damn good show bike. I hate to part with it, but I got others. Obviously, that I I ride on more of a regular basis. So, all right. Thank you for your time and happy riding.